Oh my friends, welcome back to the United Federation of Planets. As you can see, flagship construction. A new a long range exploration vessel is ready for construction, utilizing experimental technologies and enhanced engineering. Uh, this is excellent. Um, will this go the same way as the other one? I'm not fully sure. Also, we need to make sure that these star bases are connected. Uh, to the best of the abil uh, abilities. I'm not sure if we can connect through here. I don't know why this one's mine. Is the f Are you part of us? Are you... Are you my vessel? Uh, protectorate? No. Leave coalition. Oh, okay. Kick from coalition. You are a coalition member now. The Zindi Council. Are you really? Yes, you are. Great. We can finally start integrating smaller species. Uh, we want to make sure that we get the um, this one ready first. So, you go, I don't know, there. And you go there. Anything else? Wow, all the way up here, huh? Go here. Yeah, th those are definitely some pirate lanes. Also change the location of my plants. It's now down here, so I will have it open, but... Uh, mainly, I will be focusing on everything that is around here. You, research center. Let's turn this off. One, go here and assist in the research, whatever. So, you're out of the way. Can you construct anything else? Uh, no, we don't need any more of those. So, we can actually close that. Shipyard. Uh, yeah, integrating this species um, actually got us from south all the way to the core. And the Borg is massive. The Borg is huge. They are very, very frightening. And I'm hoping that these guys can actually go and do it. I don't know. You're an offensive fleet, huh? Damn. I think you might be losing. That's, uh, that's bad. That would be very bad. How about you? Also offensive well you do get a lot of territory in here you're getting the unit complex three two if you get unit complex one it is like almost game over for the board but where are your fleets a passive borg can you imagine oh that's that's just funny so uh, where are your fleets your species so thrives Oh, shut it, because that takes forever. We are the Borg. But actually, look, they were overwhelming. They are not. So I have high hopes for um, the Unimatrix being uh, a friendly type of Borg. Oh, wow, that's so annoying. Uh, let's get rid of this, 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 not that. Go, go, go. You. Great. Oh, so much, so much. Mm. Okay, so we need to focus on where do we want shipyard. So we have one over here, one over there, the other one is here, 13. One there. Uh, no, I don't think so. And one over here. Uh, I kind of want to have one, like, over here. This being a new shipyard. So if there is something going on, we can actually do it right over there. So this is going to be a shipyard. Uh, Starbase 14. Starbase 14. The other two will probably have to... Well, remove. Crew quarters. Uh, let's dismantle you. We don't need you. And we will upgrade this. You. Um, we're 16 out of 16, but, uh, naval, yes, naval capacity would be quite nice. Although, we do have a bit of a thing going on in here. Like, as you can see, there's a lot of trade we are just not getting. Getting another base in there would be quite ideal. Uh, there's not so much over here. So, yeah, let's just get rid of this base. Let us downgrade. And we can finally build another one. I think over here, the Epsilon system. Let's upgrade you to a trade depot. You. Let's downgrade you as well. We don't need you over there. 
and what we will do is i do want another presence in here somewhere there is a planet that we will take and i think we do need a star base up there wow this actually looks so nice it really looks nice and we'll be using what are you troll don't even know you yeah whatever let's just do the prime one there we go another planet will be colonized under our banner and we hope to get what the hell is this a rebellion fleet oh it's those guys oh that's annoying uh, what fleet is nearby? We'll have to deal with it. You're all the way up there. Go ahead and, and, and deal with this. <clears throat> because, uh, yeah. It's time for you to die. It, it, it had to be. It had to be like this. We'll have to boost some of these fleets up. Some of them are really using old designs. Or can we just add a few? We can add only the Seren class. Damn, that's not making me excited about anything. What is this? Commercial pack invitation? Sure, we'll take it. And we'll take that as well. And we are forming so many friends. It is unbelievable that... Look at this. Everyone is just loving me. Even the Unimatrix. And if they can win this war, they are going to be insanely big. Insanely big. Also, heads up, in the uh, next episode, I got a bit of an announcement going for you. Hopefully you will enjoy that. Um... I don't really want to spoil it right now, so not going to. Yes. Next time. Do we want to make another... Yeah, you are not connected, but we will have to do that. Uh, but we'll do that once we actually get rid of some of the other starbases. Starbase 15. So, starbase 15. Here we go. Still have to make up my mind about this one. I kind of think... Well, we could keep it. We could. You are a trade station. Uh, yeah, it will take another upgrade or two to actually get all the way. So, I want to build one next to our mega structure. Another galactic forum. The second one. So, what we will do is downgrade you and upgrade you. Starbase 16, I guess. And that's a guess. Yes, yeah, 16. Uh, let's do it like this. So, that looks a lot better. Now we can start connecting those trade routes. Uh, go here. So, you go... Where? <clears throat> is it too far away for you? That is also a possibility. This one is not connected. We might have to wait until those bases are actually built. Yeah, we might do that. And we'll connect them later. For now, let's just keep this one going and upgrade where we can upgrade. But we don't have to do that right away. Let's see, the fleets are moving. At least this fleet is moving. He's an FTL and he will go and fight off this uh, score rebel fleet who thinks he can do anything he wants. Also, let's take a look into the other areas that we uh, we are in what we will do is we will unforbid this this fleet is not doing anything he's upgraded so you might as well go here be aggressive and finally kick out some of these annoying small areas yeah definitely we have to deal with this as well and just explore them again we have so many science ships so we uh, we shouldn't be taking too long about it Full strength, you are merely upgrading, which is great. And in between episodes, I will keep focus on my planets. Or maybe just a bit right now, because we have to wait. I don't like waiting. Let's, let's enjoy how this looks. It looks hideous. 
It is absolutely hideous. Um, maybe getting the Soren Lake wouldn't feel so much as a snake, but I bet my... I know, my Galician is actually quite good. <laughs> Reinforming the government. Uh, no. <clears throat> Don't want to do that. So, food. Food is a bit of a thing, huh? That's unfortunate. Can we do anything? No. No, we can't. There's four jobs available and there's these two specialists are just pissed. Oh well, what can you do about it? Nothing. So, we have a big ass negative in terms of food. I don't like that. The great Ferengi monarchy collapses. The Grand Nagus of the Fer uh, Fer Ferengi Alliance is under heavy pressure to resign following a mishandling of an economic crisis on Ferengar. Many of the Ferengar, uh, many on Ferengar, describe how uh, rampant inflation and currency devaluation burn like wildfires through the lost financial voyage of the Ferengi. Um, this is very unfortunate. <laughs> I wonder can we integrate him I would like to integrate him but it is going to take a long ass time and more influence than we can actually have can we increase the uh, the threshold of influence we could also release the subject and Hopefully, we can uh, offer them into uh, our Concord. <clears throat> um, yeah, well, we're going to be doing the study. So, do you actually hate me? Relative power of subjects. Ah... <sighs> He could fall victim. Yeah, we're, we're, we're releasing him. And we're going to be offering him a... He's actually negative 9 on accepting this. So, let us do a research agreement. <clears throat> and... What can we... What else? Can we, let's do this one. And we should be able to invite in coalition relatively soon. Acceptance is now negative 10. Boldly go. Sure, why not? Let's take a look on what is going on. Uh, let's research this. Let's send a scientist since we have Rule so many. Rule of acquisition number 34. Go War away. is good for business. Um, <laughs> that's also done. Let's get that out. Where do we need to go? Three year contract. Uh, go to. Who is closest? I think we got a suitable candidate. Here. Uh, Richard Galen. You're going on a three year study. Uh, it must be must be great having that also let's take a look because we have a few changes we have the uh, the new cruiser who absolutely looks sick i love it um you are now on the experimental frontal cannon or advanced cruiser i like the advanced cruiser though tactical quarters i, I do um, yeah let's just take the tactical quarters Trans warp conduit auto upgrade the Excelsior class ship. Look at those shields, man. Look at those shields. Those are fantastic. Let's save you. Um, we don't see the other flagship here, so can we construct him or will it be done? Also, uh, we got some new upgrades for this, so that's quite nice. Some of the options they select are just plain old dumb um, what we need on, on these guys is like speed 
a shield emitters that's nice but can we do something about the, the speed not really so you are okay how about the scientist yeah we'll just add all of those again let's just get this and it looks so good it really looks amazing i don't know what era this precisely is in we could be between like kirk and picard or even further if you know let me know because uh yeah you guys know a lot more than i do uh, let's get what what does it actually say lab module can only be placed on a science ship it doesn't really do well let's get free on them whatever i don't know if it actually works like that if it doesn't let me know if you've tried it I'd be very interested in hearing that. Getting the uh, the next cruiser in here would be uh, very cool. Second stage refit. Like, damn. <clears throat> I like refits a lot. Extended tactical quarters. Engineering quarters. Extended science. Extended engineering. Let's go with extended engineering. Just uh, do all of this. That's fine. Constitution class has changed. You can see it changed. Do we have other one as well? Battle cruiser space superiority doesn't feel better. Let's see if there is extended. No. So this didn't change. How about the Explorer Miranda class? Wow, we got the gallant retrofit, and we're using the Miranda. And this one is just—it has to be better. I think so. Uh, let's go with extended tactical. We are going to be upgrading a lot of our ships again. Uh, Vulcan cruiser. No changes. We're not using it anyways. Uh, light cruiser. Still the Kelvin. No other options. And the frigate. Yeah. I, I, I don't, I'm not feeling the frigate. <laughs> I'm not feeling it. Look, they, they look amazing. I've never showed this to you guys. And I should have done that. These ships are... Well, apart from this one, I don't like this. <laughs> it's a stick and a round. Cool. Um, but these ships look so cool. And there we go. actually got the Reliant ref uh, Retrofit. So that's quite nice. Um, the multi-class ship. The Battle Cruiser. Feels, uh, feels like uh, the Defiant ship a bit. I know, I know. It's not. I am aware. And this feels still feels like Kirk's ship. And but this starts to feel like Picard's ship. Uh, it's it, it should be a bit higher on here, but uh, perhaps we can make it. I'm actually awaiting the changes on it. So what we do need to do <clears throat> Yes, I can do language a tiny bit. Scroll all the way up here because that's the best thing I can do. Um who is just waiting, not doing anything? You are there no upgrades for you? Oh, that's quite unfortunate. It, it's probably why you are the strongest ship in the in the in in the fleet right now. I don't want to change this. We're not making that many alloys, so there's no point in doing all of it. You have you dealt? Actually, I think they're just gone. Fine, let's go retrofit you. Can we upgrade you with some other class? Uh, a team of human languages have made significant progress in understanding the Tamar language. And uh, we can finally talk to them so we can have diplomatic relations. Do we want to get... Let's get the advanced cruiser in here if possible. It's not possible. Oh well. Uh, what a little we can do then. And how many? Uh, how, how much can we do? So we're still building up, and we're currently seven seven three. So not all of our ships are just ready. Also, you go upgrade. Anyone else? No, which is good. Let us talk to. Where are you? Is it? It's these guys. Jiri, of Ubaya. Obaya of crossroads <clears throat> at Lunga, Lunga, her sky grey. So, they look used like 50 words to say be silent enemy. 
You are not my. You're just unfriendly. You're pathetic. What we can do is um, is do what we do best. We uh, we trade, right? That is uh, that is our ways. So uh, let's uh, let's try sweet talking the Tama Tamarian Union. So let's offer you a trade deal, and it needs to be significant. So once again, let's just go with the 10, 30 years. Oh, that's not actually doing a lot. Energy. Wow, this is even doing worse. How much magnesite do we make? We're making 16. Let's do 5. And the other one. We're making 14. We can do 5 again. I I'm going to make this the, the worst deal ever. Okay, so 338. You're up. His you will accept that. On the river Negative 19 commercial pack invitation. And this is now receptive. They're no longer well hostile towards me. Research agreement. Negative 12. And eventually this will um, definitely go towards being friends with this weird empire. And even trying to get them into the federation would be a welcomed thing. My minerals do concern me. But most of them are in here. And I, I'm i going... Uh, the way my other series is going, I, uh, I'm not sure about hand letting the AI handle it. But come on, man. We got 52 planets in here. It's not like I'm going to do that solo. What I'll do off camera in between is just take a look at those star bases. Connecting them. Uh, building them up more. And hopefully merge these two fleets because that's bugging me. And take a look at my planet. See if we can actually boost some more minerals. For now, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.